FC Barcelona has been working hard to bolster its ranks with the addition of some quality players this season. One of the big targets for the Catalan Giants has been the German midfielder Ilke Gundogan, who currently plays for Manchester City. The club is keen on signing Gundogan, who is set to become a free agent this summer, but is facing some financial constraints. Barcelona has been in talks with Gundogan's representatives for some time now, with the player himself reportedly keen on a move to the Camp Nou. The 30-year-old is a versatile midfielder who can play in a variety of positions and has been in fine form for City this season, scoring 12 goals in all competitions. However, Barcelona's financial situation is not ideal, and the club is facing some tough decisions this summer. The COVID-19 pandemic has hit the club hard, with revenues plummeting and debts rising. The club is currently in a precarious financial position, with a debt of over 1 billion euros, and is looking to cut costs wherever possible. This has made it difficult for Barcelona to compete with other top European clubs who are also interested in signing Gundogan. The German midfielder is reportedly on the radar of several top teams, including Paris Saint-Germain and Juventus. These clubs have the financial muscle to offer Gundogan a lucrative contract, something that Barcelona may struggle to match. Despite these challenges, Barcelona is still hopeful of signing Gundogan and is working on a deal that suits both parties. The club is reportedly offering the midfielder a three-year contract with an option for a fourth year, which would see him earn around 8 million euros per season. This is a significant reduction from Gundogan's current salary at City, but still represents a decent wage for the player. Gundogan is said to be considering Barcelona's offer, but is also keeping his options open. The German international has been in excellent form this season and is keen to continue playing at the highest level. He is reportedly attracted by the prospect of playing under Ronald Koeman, who he believes can help him develop as a player. The next few weeks will be crucial for Barcelona as they try to secure Gundogan's signature. The club is also looking to offload several high-earning players this summer, including Philippe Coutinho and Samuel Umtiti, to free up some funds. If they can manage to do so, they may be able to offer Gundogan a more attractive deal and beat off competition from other clubs. In conclusion, Barcelona's pursuit of Ilke Gundogan is a sign of the club's ambition to return to the top of European football. However, the financial constraints they are facing make it a difficult task. If they can manage to strike a deal with Gundogan, it would be a significant coup for the club and a boost to their chances of success next season.